Roadmaps and Timelines Many project managers use these terms interchangeably, but did you know that they aren't the same? Getting them mixed up can confuse others and sink overall productivity. The good news is that you can easily tell roadmaps and timelines apart using four distinct features. Even better, you can use both roadmaps and timelines in JIRA to successfully complete your projects. If you want to know how to understand the differences between roadmaps and timelines and use them in JIRA to plan, track, and manage projects, then you're in the right place. Just keep watching. What's the difference between a roadmap and a timeline? A roadmap provides a big picture view of product development guided by business goals and customer insights. It is good for showing long-term product development plans that must be executed linearly or phase by phase. And of course, no roadmap is complete without product goals, strategic objectives, major features, and release plans. You can think of a timeline as a mini roadmap. A timeline shows the tasks, resources, processes, and deadlines necessary for project management. Since they are mini roadmaps, timelines have shorter strategies to address product improvements, both iteratively and linearly. The key components of timelines are product improvements, resource management, risk management, and deadlines. In short, Roadmaps give you the long-term macro view of product and business development. While timelines provide a short-term micro view of project management. Now comes the fun part, project planning using JIRA Roadmap. To access this feature, Make sure you're using a next-gen project in JIRA software. Then, enable the roadmap feature in the project settings. Roadmap provides a big picture view of product goals. So group the development initiatives required to accomplish these goals into epics. Next, add user stories or issues into each epic. Issues help to define what needs to be done to efficiently deliver value to your customers. Remember, a roadmap progresses phase by phase, so map dependencies between epics on the roadmap to prevent blockers from slowing you down. Your product roadmap is now ready. But to start working on the issues efficiently, you need a timeline. JIRA doesn't offer a built-in timeline, so we'll power up our JIRA with a Gantt chart add-on. Now, we can see and manage all of our issues using a convenient Gantt-based timeline. We can drag and drop dependencies between issues to prevent unexpected delays. and we can easily add milestones to help us move forward throughout our project workflow. One of the cool things in this Gantt chart app is its smart resource allocation feature. This instantly alerts us about resources that are overcommitted, so we can prevent them from becoming bottlenecks. With a clear timeline, it's easier than ever to visualize our success. Now that our plan is in place, we'll want to ensure that it stays on track. Jira Roadmap makes it easy with a convenient progress line feature. We're also able to drill down into each epic to see real-time progress updates. The green segment shows us completed issues. The blue segment indicates issues that are in progress, while the gray segment shows us issues that haven't been started yet. 
Jira Roadmap is great if all we need is a high-level view of product development. But what if we need to anticipate and prevent potential delays in the project? That's where it pays to use a Gantt-based timeline. A Gantt chart allows us to see the critical path and ensure that there aren't any blockers in our way. The critical path is highlighted in red, so you can't possibly miss it. Great project managers know how important it is to stay on top of progress throughout the project. This Gantt chart allows us to track the progress rate of individual tasks simply by hovering over the Gantt chart bar. And just like Jira Roadmap, a Gantt-based timeline also has a progress line. This allows us to instantly check in on the progress points of each task. These tracking features give us a powerful set of tools for managing our projects and achieving our goals. Now that you know a bit more about roadmaps and timelines, use them to easily plan, track, and manage your projects in JIRA. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting videos on project management or check out our official website to learn more about WBS Gantt Chart for JIRA.